what is going on guys it's Jimmo here and known as Cutter Master Jimmo in today's video I will be showing you guys how to mod GTA modded accounts aka I'm gonna show you how to mod accounts with serendipity mod menu and uh, well obviously the recovery menu will be on and yeah and I'll show you the steps how you get online and if this is your first time making a modded account and uh, for like first time modders this is all you gotta do, just follow the steps what I'm doing, you just do this and once you get to this point and then you hold L2 and down D-pad, you hold them both down at the same time and you should hear that noise in the background and once you hear that noise it lets you to skip the tutorial online tutorial and then once you've done that and then that will skip it for you and then you should get a notification that you've skipped it so I'm pretty sure I did it or no I wouldn't done that but if it does when you're coming up to this point when you're making a fresh new account you just go ahead and do that you press you hold L2 and down d-pad and you should hear the sound of opening the serendipity mod menu you'll hear that sound and it'll pretty much bypass this and it'll let you online and uh, I'm just gonna skip this part and I'll speed this up till the point where um, I'm on pretty much the point where I'm online. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so now we're at the part where I was trying to tell you. What well, I'm going to tell you, what you can do now once you're modding this account. When you're modding accounts, when you get to this point, then you start doing the recovery. So you have, the if you want the same loader, mod loader as I am, and you can do the recovery exact same like option as what I'm doing. And then you can go ahead and download that in the description. It's in the description, guys. I'll leave that in the link in the description. And if you want to buy Serendipity, I'll leave that in the description. So this is when you do the recovery. Uh, when you put it in level, when you get to this point. So he wanted level 200. So you do that, and you do 600 million to, for account to transfer over to PS4. And now you do your unlocks, which I'm doing currently right now. And you do the time editor. You put that over 30 days and that will make it look more 100% legit and then you put your kills well your races and then your kills so you put your kills higher than your death ratio it's obviously because then you can you get a barricade it's most likely you do this and you just click on every single one unlock trophies and you use this mini recovery menu and you use that all all the way down to uh, mental state 100% and you click on on the second option the other stuff all of this like what I just did here in this menu here you click on every single one and that will give them absolutely unlimited everything and obviously all, all of that as well and that's you done that's how you know when you should done a recovery the only time when you know you've done a recovery perfectly is when you fall through the ground and I'll show you in a second so okay now we're coming up to the point where he's going to come out of the car at the point here when he comes out of the car he will fall straight through the ground and then you press start and you go ahead and press online and then this is the point where I'll show you that he'll fall through the ground this is the only time when you know you've done a recovery perfectly done perfectly correct you know so you'll fall through the ground three two one and then you press start and go online to search for a new session and then there you go and once you're in a new session all the unlocks notifications and everything will pop up all the notifications for um, trophies obviously right there as you can tell and pretty much that's how you do uh, GTA 5 modded accounts and um, if you want more tips on this like to do if you want another video for me to do the other accounts like aka let's do mw3 how to mod mw3 accounts i'll 
I'm happy to do that. And yeah, sorry guys, I've not been uploading for ages. It's because I have been very busy. I mean, I've been modern accounts, plus I've been out and I come in and it's just like I'm busy. And I come back and I'm trying to upload a video and I'm trying to edit a video, but I just can't do it. Because I just, I don't know, I just forget about it and I am I'm, can't forget about it because of this. I really want to keep going with YouTube and from now I think I can upload daily from now or something like that. Like one a video per two days. Um, I don't know, something like that. And if you want more tips on how to mod accounts pretty quickly, um, just drop a comment below and I'll, I'll help you out with that. And as you can tell, I'm online and all the unlocks are coming through. Um, level 200, ready to transfer. And obviously you need an RTM tool. I'll put it up on screen right here, right now. Um, I'll show you an RTM tool that you can use uh, to click the button you press transfer and, and it comes up hashtag 1, OK. And it's all the way down and you press OK and you press it again. And you press transfer and, it's, and then you're able to transfer to PS4. And that's how you make your model accounts for PS4 for next gen consoles. And I hope you and you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and peace the fuck out. Peace. And I've forgotten to say this, guys. Um, static mods. Search them up on YouTube. Uh, he clickbaits because he just put that in my live chat. Look, here's proof. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Peace the fuck out, guys.